Orangefield, Hart, and Jefferson. Look, like you just said, both teams, they already locked up their playoff berth, but tonight was all about seeding third and fourth. There is Old Glory hanging way above over there at Orangefield. Check this out. This is HJ. They're going to fumble here on the opening kickoff. No problems, though. They're going to get the ball immediately or right back, though, since Orangefield couldn't get nothing going on the offense. Jaden Porter, though, is going to roll out, find Dakota Air McNair there for the first down. Then Porter here on the keeper. He's going to escape a few defenders, take it up the middle there for a nice and 20 yard gain. But it's time for some more slot team mafia. This time it's going to be from the Bobcats. Gunnar Jones pitches it to Dwight Davis there for the first down. You know they like to run. Here comes our guy, Hunter Ashworth. Going to take the handoff there, hit the outside. It's small, but it's another little first down. Then Gunnar Jones here on the keeper. He's going to take it to the outside now. He's going to get to the left side there and hit it for the first down. Then Jones this time is going to find, they can actually pass two, folks, to McCoy Mays there for the nine-yard pickup. Then Ashworth is going to power his way into the end zone. Bobcats up 7-0, but they are not going to be able to knock off those Harden Jefferson Hawks as they take this one in overtime. 19 to 13. And from what I'm doing, if I, you know, carried the one and everything I needed to do, Orangefield should be taking on Sealy in the first round. Harden Jefferson uh, will get the Belleville Bramus. The Bramus, not the Brahmas, but the Bramus. That's right.